always want to get back to whenever we were playing some more Empire's Undergrowth. Um, last time you remember we um um we beat Far Cry One of Bridge Too Far. I actually failed that very miserably. Um, so we're gonna have to do that again, except this time. We're doing on easy. I did on medium when I lost bad. I also um I also use this one where they become to free hatch because I'm like, well, if you need a lot of food, then this will be better. But no, it's still garbage. So we're using the better one, which so they do more damage and has speed and attack and stuff upon hatching, so we can actually take out the stupid giant lizards that were protecting us from killing the uh the um, blue skimmer. So we just couldn't kill the skimmers because they were protecting me. There's a bunch of lizards. I, I didn't upload this. Um, this so fire ant queen has traveled for miles on her nuptial flight, finally landing atop a sandy mound deep in the swamp. The vantage point might seem like an ideal home, but it may be short lived. This whole area is liable to flooding, and nearby rainfall is already causing the groundwater to rise. Exhausted and without her wings, the queen is unable to move on alone. But if she can amass enough daughters in time, the colony as a whole may stand a chance. I want to see how much easier. So last time it was like, a, like 200 or something. Wow, okay. That, that's a lot better. It's a lot higher number than this crap. Never mind, I need. Okay, so. I'm just going to expand in absolutely every direction. I guess we can also dig this way. Oh, there's a ton of food down there. Go down there. Many nearby creatures have already been washed out of their homes by the rising water. A lucky few have been deposited on the shores east of the nest. As more arrive, tensions will rise. There isn't space here for everyone. I'm just gonna get a good chunk of ants before I go outside the nest. So they don't die to stupid frogs. Up here, come on. Come on. Predators are loose in the nest. The larvae must yes, I be know. protected. I saw him. I saw him. <coughs> the ants must fight. Okay. 
Okay. I think it's probably time to open up to the surface. Because there is still a ton of food on the surface. 29. Nice. <laughs> <coughs> oh, excuse me. Um, yeah, this is the blue skimmer, and it lands later in the game, and you could kill it, but I, I just A great blue skimmer, Liba Lula Vibrans, hunts overhead. This fantastic aerial predator shouldn't cause any trouble for the ants. That is, unless it decides to land in their way. Food is abundant. But as the flood water begins to rise, the ants will quickly lose access to the lower lands. Okay, so... The colony is starving. There's not enough food to feed the new brood. Okay, so we're just going to head over here, and we're going to take all this freaking food. Kill, no, kill that one. Amongst the melee of panicking creatures are larvae of the false bombardier no, beetle. Already there. large and accomplished predators, they will hold their ground against close. small groups of ants. An ant has found itself entangled on the sticky tentacle of a dwarf sundew. As it tries to struggle free, more tentacles are drawn in, drowning the victim in thick mucilage. Jumping spider. The boggy earth at the base of the mound is now saturated, and as like night approaches, the water begins to creep closer. Like the new arrivals will rush to higher ground, heading straight for the nest. There is nowhere else to go. I mean, yeah, you could just, like, not head to the nest. Can you just, like, not? No. Take the food in! Oh, wait, shoot. We're full on food. Take the food inside, everyone. I need a lot of ants. So many ants. So much. Go this way. Go kill them. There. Don't let them get to the nest. Okay, the water is ruined. Oh, yes, they gathered them. A bunch of the time. Okay, I'm just glad they didn't go into that pitcher plant. I'm doing much better than last time. Well, the last time I was doing it medium, so it was a lot harder, but. Okay, the first night, this is going to be very hard, actually. I'm going to just put down a lot more food piles so we can store a bit of food. I don't have to keep going back into the ground to place ants, just upgrade stuff, because it's just upgrade all ones. I'm actually going to get some workers. Just like... Just a couple nest workers. I guess let's go here. I have 40 something ants, so. That should be fine. This way we're going up there. Keep the water coming out. Come this way. Where are you going? 
on, is there another ramp down from the nest somewhere? Oh, there is, if you can go this way. I didn't know that. The inundation has slowed, and fewer creatures are washing up to the Actually, east. Up here the ants have an opportunity to explore for food, but there are other dangers at night. Moist-skinned amphibians have come out to take advantage of this new water world, harvesting lost insects displaced from their burrows. I know sometimes things will, like, float through up here. That's kind of funny. Is there going to be a frog coming out of nowhere? Is there going to be a frog coming out of nowhere? Okay. Don't see a frog. I'm going to see if I can get over there. Oh, I don't think I have enough ants at all. Okay, this second wave would get us over there. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Go get the aphids. Last time I actually didn't get any aphids till late in the game when the skimmer attacked. And I can actually put the eight workers I said I would have in the nest um, on aphid collecting duty. Pinewood, pinewood, pinewood. Pinewood. I just want to go back. You got your aphids and everything? A pine woods tree frog, Gila femoralis, has wandered into the trail. This one has taken a break from mate calling for a quick meal. See, and I it knew seems there was going to be one there. Are on I knew the there menu. was going to be one. The colony is starving. There is not enough food to feed the new brood. There we go. Um, let's go for this one. And then I'll have you guys here. Yeah, see, this is a lot smaller village. I'll go back there in a second. I just want to. I just want to get the these. Okay, let's go back over here. You no, know actually, come up here. Those caterpillars are worth so much that I just. It would be stupid of me not to go get them. Like, oh shoot. Okay. Let's just go over there. I'm gonna actually turn food on, so if they see like a seat or something, oh. Uh, yeah, that means that a lot of these guys are going to die. An ant has plants. fallen victim to a carnivorous plant. And sundews, but I can live with that. <gasps> Just gather up, gather up. I'm going to put myself on this one. Okay, let's go down there. I think... Where are they? Oh, they're both over here. Why are... Why are those two together? It's, it's so stupid because that means you have to kill them both while they're next to each other. Okay. <gasps> he, he went away. He went away. The battle has begun. Let's see where Seltz is at. No, kill it. Kill it. Kill it. Kill this one. <laughs> is he going to do the hurt thing? Yes, he's doing the hurty thing. Oh. He, he's out. Whoa. Oh, my God. He's, he's out. He's gone. I legit don't know where he went. Yeah, these numbers are a lot more, like, reasonable. Okay, you die.
it's already d taking some damage. And then when the rest, when I get some balance together. I have all of these guys here. Whoa. Oh, jumping spider. They just reused the sound um, of the other jumping spider, I'm pretty sure. Okay, you know what? I'm, I have to go for it. I can't just leave those aphids there. I left three there. Come on, faster. Fire step. Stuff we're gonna start washing up soon. This is definitely where one of the places <laughs> where they're washing up. One probably around here, and one probably around here ish. Okay, wait, food off, food off, food off. Oh no, water's about gonna rise. Water's gonna rise, okay. Come on, come on. All my heads are gonna die for this. Just go. All of you, come on. I have my finger in backspace. Go for the aphids. Clear up on it. Okay, back, 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 back. Run, 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 run. If you have an aphid, then good, because that, you did the job. Oh, that one's the only one with the boost. Oh, you guys better run. Oh, I'm going to lose my whole army here. Please, someone at least get the aphids. Oh, oh, oh. Yes, no, I don't. Actually. 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 No, what? He, he's like here, and he, he just randomly died. Continued rainfall is about to bring another torrent flushing through the bog, carrying with it a slew of ill-tempered arthropods. Yeah, okay, they're going to start washing up here. I'm just going to go sit down here for, for the day. Because there's this, and then there's a bunch of stuff washing up, like these small little worm things. Yes, we got a good start this time. Yes, yes, no, food on, actually, food on. There we go. Take the caterpillars. Anything else gonna wash up? False bottom field beetle, one of those guys, one of those guys. And three of those guys were, there's a pine cone, actually, and then a bunch of those guys. I'm going over here. It's, there's a lot more food. And I just can't pass that up. The ants must you know defend what? themselves. You know what? Actually, I'm going to put you there. I'm going to put you there. Yeah, I'm going to make another group next to the workers. <laughs> just in time, too. I'm going to keep these guys in the nest. There are intruders so in the nest. Whenever these guys spawn, I guess. I did that last time and it didn't really work out, but I'm stupid, so I'm going to do it again. Oh, God. Spray, 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 spray. Yes. An ant has fallen victim it. to a I'm carnivorous plant. You wasted plant. your formic acid on one of these fire ants. 
One loss is very small. This is my area. Okay, I actually do want to still expand my main group, though. And I also want to upgrade my food stores. The workers have done all they can to improve these food stores. And there goes the pine cone. Uh, no, they're going to go for that now because they're stupid. We'll go over there. Okay, there we go. Now we just send those guys over there. But I'm actually going to put group 1 down here and send group 2 right there. So group 2, who, who's been on the Aether farm the whole time, finally get to be free and go and travel a little farther. The ants must defend themselves. What? What did one wander over here and then this guy like spray him or something? I don't know. I honestly don't know. Let's see. Are they carrying anything big though? No. What attacked them? I just I just heard the the death screech or something. No, you didn't see anything. Oh, creatures are about to attack. Let's come down here so we can actually get the food, too. And kill that guy. The battle has begun. You can, yeah, see, so you can actually kill him before he finishes his spray. In fact, you can kill him before he even uses his spray if, you're, if, you, if you have a big enough army. I'm pretty sure that I don't actually have any enemies coming. Pretty sure I actually killed them all. <gasps> Ooh, wait, if it rises, I think I can go over there. With nowhere to drain, the flood water creeps ever nearer to the nest. Already cramped and irritated, a panic ensues, and the refugees scramble for higher ground. Let's do it like that. We'll get some tier threes in here. Okay, here we go. I sneezed, but I didn't lay it down, and that hurt. Okay. Oh, wait, group two go... Wait, group two needs to go back to the Aether Farms. Can I go over here? <gasps> I can! Okay, I'm going to throw the ones that were in the nest out into, into group one because I really need a good force over here if I'm going to kill them. Also, I want to steal all their aphids. Yes, this is such a small gap for this many ants. I have 91 ants. I'll easily be able to cross over. The problem with the ones that hatch for free is sometimes, like, if you don't have any food, you're, like, waiting for them to hatch, and your worker just can't play the, place the eggs down fast enough. That's really the only problem with them. Like, you can't actually place the eggs down fast enough. They'll need a lot of workers. Uh, 
let's just quickly kill these guys. The ants must fight. Yes, yes, they they will fight. We must murder them. Oh, you know what? Fight off? Just run into the nest, honestly. Yeah, he's gonna die, but I got so many ants in here. Oh, wait, is he... I don't think he did die. I think he, that he's still alive, actually. The little black ants have been defeated. The fire ants must pillage the nest quickly and hurry home while they still can. I did it very early, so I should get... The colony is starving. Out. There's Stop. not enough food to feed the new brood. Back. I think when you do it, all and everything turns to this, all the ants just like die <laughs> slowly. And it's like painful to watch because they all just slowly. News die. of the insect feast has spread across the swamp. Oh god. With growing numbers of amphibians patrolling the waters, the Invictors scavenging expeditions will need to be well defended. I I'm like I thought that this was like was like a frog or something, I'm like whoa and it scared me. A colony of little black ants marooned on a smaller section <clears throat> of the mound may be reachable if the fire ants join together to bridge the gap. No, actually they're dead and they've been dead. I love how there's always triggers in this game. I love triggers because you can do something before the trigger happens and it just breaks the game. Like, like, I already defeated them, but he's just telling me about them after I've already killed them. I'm going to upgrade these guys just because I know it makes them bigger, and I really hope that um, Slug Disco, um, like, the, 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 the devs remember this. An Eastern Meat, Notofalmus Viridations, uh -oh. is devouring ants. Uh, Growing up to 10 centimeters in length, it dwarfs other creatures on the mound. Its red skin is toxic and serves as a warning to potential predators. Kill it. A scavenging expedition can continue once you kill it. There we go. Boop. Three. I wish you could eat the queen. At the same time, she is freaking tiny. Okay, wait, group three, come across and grab the aphids. So we need, let's see, 17 more sages and more diamond. So it says I need 17. It says I need 15. Yes, because I got that to level three, and every time you upgrade it, they get not only get bigger, but they, um, yes, yes, okay, but they add one at level three. So I'm just going to keep upgrading these. And I do want to actually kill the skimmer. Just, just to show you guys, like, h how I lost last time. Because <laughs> it was kind of stupid. Okay, go over there. Just grab all the food from there, honestly. I just, I, I could use it all. I'm not actually sure if I can show you guys the like social rays there, and then this will be the lowest level. No, we're, I think we're gonna have to wait for this level. Oh, we actually won! Nice. I don't care. No. Okay, actually, I, th I think I can't wait for it. Did you get the aphids? Okay. Everyone in group one. Gather, gather. 
And I was like, yeah, just gather it up here. I'm, okay, everyone gather, gather at the top of the hill or whatever. Yeah, gather there. Let's just get more. I honestly wish that it would land when you, like, get the numbers, that the skimmer would land just so you could fight it and have, and it would be fun. Okay, and scattered. The funny thing is, you don't actually need all your ants at the top of the hill. You just need, you need to gather 50 more ants at the top of the hill. You just get, need to gather some ants at the top of the hill, not the complete amount. Wait, actually, can I, can I get them all? Oh, they do actually move faster than they go up there. Interesting. Honestly, I wish it that the skimmer would land. You know. Yeah, leave the top of the hill. This would land, and then this would be. <gasps> Wait, no, that would flood, and then we're going to have to make. So, if you want to fight, we're going to have to wait for day. Mm, yeah, I think I think it's I think it's time. I think it's time. Everyone, go. Unless the skimmer wants to freaking land. I don't actually see a skimmer. Wait, where even is it? Oh, come on. It literally disappears. By I mean, joining their bodies in. together to form a giant raft, the fire ants were able to ferry the queen from the mound just as the nest filled with water. Their perils are not over, but they've shown great resilience and an ability to survive in this harsh environment. Wherever they land, the creatures of the swamp will quickly come to know the might of the fire ants. Yes, yes, victory. It just took two tries and we need to do that easy. <laughs> uh. Okay, let's see. I think we're gonna go extra food. Yes, yes. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Eat yes. hearty. Grow strong. The work will continue soon. Hello? Shh, shh. <coughs> oh, it's you. Is something wrong? No. This is where I don't really know which one's better. So, last stand upon reaching. Yeah, but they also. So, last stand upon reaching zero health, the fire ant returns to full health, but only survives for the first few seconds with reduced attack speed but that but that makes it so it doesn't hit as fast well last love upon death the fire ant deals high damage to uh its nearest enemy if close enough <gasps> yeah well if it dies it's going to probably be in a melee combat you know what i mean so i think last laugh is actually probably more effective since i've played with this one around in free play it's weak so weak it doesn't really change anything. So we're going for that one. We're also going to make sure you guys upgrades. How much does this cost? 80? Okay, there we go. We got everyone upgraded with good abilities, I'm pretty sure. Yes, 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 yes. Okay. Well, anyways, I hope you guys all enjoyed this video. Um, Make sure to like and subscribe. Next time we'll be doing um, the Former Carnium Challenge 4. And I'll see you next time. Bye.